O-H. Now you say I-O. And that is the way people from Ohio learn to spell the name of their state. Hi, what's up? My name is Maddie. I live in my minivan and I'm on a mission to go on an adventure and drink a beer in each of the 50 states. And today I'm in, you guessed it, Ohio. suggestions for where to go in Ohio. A lot of people said Cayuga Valley National Park. A lot of people said Mohican, but the most common answer was Hocking Hills State Park. So that's where I am now. I started the day with the most popular trail, Old Man Cave, and people said it would be really crowded. So I tried to get here in the morning and even though it was 10 a.m. it was still super crowded so you know it was pretty i understand why people like it so the more people getting out and enjoying nature the better even though the trails are kind of crowded Right now, I'm doing the Cedar Falls Trails, which does have a lot of people on it, but it's not like everywhere you look, there's people. It was pretty crowded, especially at the end. It was pretty nice. Reminded me of Kentucky. Now, I'm gonna try to find somewhere less crowded to eat something. After lunch, I'm feeling kind of tired, but another recommendation for me was Conkle's Hollow Rim Trail. Doing it now. So far there's been some signs warning about cliffs. So that should be interesting.
I don't really know what to do with my life next. I could try to find somewhere to take a shower and then try to find somewhere to sleep or I could just pay for a campground where I can shower and sleep. I do pay a lot in insurance. And when I made this van, I worked really hard to make sure I could just sleep anywhere, but thinking that might just be worth it. I did end up reserving a campground. It was 32.50, so not my favorite, but you know, whatever. Um, the bad news, though, is that I was using iOverlander instead of Google Maps to look at campsites. So, I accidentally booked a campsite that was 40 minutes away. And I was driving past other campsites and I was like, I didn't even try to see how much they cost or if they had availability. But, oh well. I'm in a really pretty place. It's called Lake Alma. And my campsite has a creek it also has a dumpster now if i were a responsible adult i would start making dinner because it's 5 15 but or take a shower but i don't really feel like it what i feel like doing is setting up my hammock and having a beer Another thing a lot of people recommended to me was Jackie O's Brewing. So I got this kind because it has an owl on it. We'll see if the, the beer measures up to the can. Nice and foamy. Very good. So I'm making prepackaged elote for the first time which is gonna be interesting. I don't really know what I'm doing, but that's the fun of it. I think I put too much oil. The direction said two tablespoons, but I have no idea how much that is. Prepackaged cheese. It would have helped to have a bigger frying pan, but other than that, I think I did pretty good. So good. Next up, shower time in a very foggy stall got that done but now I'm worried about how cold it's gonna be outside. Luckily it feels perfectly fine outside. When I was making dinner I was in shorts and a t-shirt and I was a little chilly but now that I'm in sweatshirt and sweatpants like I am fine. Nothing to worry about. As much as I was not a fan of having to pay $32.50 to camp here, it is pretty nice to be hanging out outside, have hot water to make tea, be putting my feet up on a picnic table. It's pretty nice.
starting my day off with a nice healthy bowl of honey nut cereal. I'm tired, it's gray out. Sounds like a perfect day for eating. So, he, okay, so he did not buy this. Bro, I am so full. That was so good. It's come to my attention that chili dogs are mostly a Cincinnati thing, but you know, I don't really have time to drive to Cincinnati just for lunch today. When I was in that restaurant, I also checked my number of subscribers and it got up to 3,000 and I can't tell you all how exciting and validating and just incredible that is. If you're a subscriber, I appreciate the heck out of ya. Thank you. Ohio is great. It really reminds me of Kentucky, especially the region where Red River Gorge is. But for now, I gotta get a move on. I'm going from Ohio to Ohio. Pile, Ohio Pile State Park, Pennsylvania. Hope to see you then. Thank you for watching. Bye.